for children's story. So come on children and collect the money. Money. Don't forget to say thank you. Madi, what's going on? Okay, the children's story this morning is called Keeper the Light. Do you know what is the lighthouse? You know what is a lighthouse? Yeah, so I'm gonna talk about Mari and his father. So Mari's father was the keeper of the lighthouse on the coast of England. The light of this lamp shines at the night to guide the ships on their way and to keep them from the dangerous rocks to not, you know, like I have an accident. The lighthouse seemed to say, take care for rocks and sands are here. Keep a good lookout and mind how you sail or you will be lost. One afternoon, Mary was in the lighthouse by herself. Mary's father get ready everything for the night. And in the evening, he said, Mary, I need you to stay in the lighthouse because I had to go some shopping, some food, because they need some grocery. So to the way to go to the, to the town, he had to walk through a road but he had to do it early because you only have to, they all have to use it only like three or two hours per day because when the evening come down, the water from the sea take, a, take the road to. So, um, Mary, it, it was only Mary and her father because sadly her mother passed away. So, when Mary's father go to the grocery store and Mary stay in the lighthouse, guess what happened? That was few men behind some rocks waiting for Mary's father. They knew Mary, Mary was by herself in the lighthouse, but the, the other thing too was they always people, men try to steal because the chips they're coming from the sea to a, a safe place, they bring things with value. So they think, well, I'm gonna take from them so I can sell. Well, anyway, so Mary's father was really worried because he need to get soon to the lighthouse because Mary was by herself. When we when, when back from the store, guess what happened? So the guy stole her, his food. He put that like around her feet, feet, the wrist and the and the feet. And they hide him and they hide him in a shed and they walk away. Right? And cover her, his mouth and everything. And he starts, oh my lord, 
Mary is by herself in the lighthouse. It's storming coming. I don't know what to do. Mary instead was start to get worried because it was already 6 o'clock, 7 o'clock, 8 o'clock in the night. And I said, what am I going to do? So Mary said, Daddy, hurry up. I need your help. So father, Mary's father can get out from the shed because he was tied up and with them. So he started praying and asked God, help Mary, keep him safe and all that stuff. But Mary was always with his father all the time. So he know, she knew how to turn on the light of the lighthouse. And she said, mm, what am I going to do? Everything is ready. The only thing I have to do is turn on the light. And she, and she was worried because she think, oh, maybe I'm not going to reach. But she could. So she could uh, uh, turn on the light so the sheep, when they see the light, they couldn't came safe. And this will remind me, Jesus. It's a son I don't remember, the leaders right now, but the people we born and grew up in the Adventist church, remember her to singers? The song, The Lighthouse? Mm-hmm, mm -hmm, honey, in the lighthouse. Father's, Mary's father live a really rough moment, right? But he couldn't see, he could see when Mary turned on the light. And he knew she was safe. Jesus is our lighthouse. Sometimes we go in dark places, right? Or we feel fear or scared. Remember, Jesus is the lighthouse. And he's always willing to lead you to a light place with a lot of light, say, with no worries, just follow the light, Jesus. Now it's time to back to your seat and remember we are God's house. We have to be quiet. Go now. Mm -hmm.